Welcome to Enjoying Life, a program of music, chatter, and friends designed to put a refreshing moment in your day. Now, please welcome your award-winning hosts, Dr. Jerry and Little Jan. Thank you, Paul. Thank you so much. You know, I love Paul and Sheila, don't you? Yeah, you yeah. know, Sheila is this... People think that I'm short, uh -huh. but Sheila is short, isn't she? Yeah, she's she, she shorter and than you are. Sheila and they I, call you little Jan, and she's shorter than you <laughs> yeah. are. But uh, for I'm you so that glad, don't know. I'm so glad that you guys are here with us to enjoy life. Uh, you talking about the people out in the audience? I'm talking about the folks that just came in on the, on the show. Oh, we are glad they're here. We love to run into you. We see you at concerts <laughs> and churches and different places where we are, and it always makes us smile. We love to meet you. So say hello when we run into Absolutely. you in person. We and we've got it. some wonderful guests that are going to be on oh, the program today, too. Oh, my goodness, yes. How long have you been knowing these folks? Forever. Forever? I'm not putting. A, I'm not going to put a number on it. Oh, you're not, because no. that really goes back. Doesn't it? <laughs> but they, they had some of the greatest hits in Southern gospel music. They certainly. And a lot of folks really, really love them, and they they're going to be excited them. to see them in person. Mm -hmm. We're excited about that. Yes, we are. Well, I guess we better get to singing. Let's sing a song right okay. now. Okay, here's a song that I was reading the Bible, and I was reading in the Book of John, the golden text of the Bible, and that's when I saw this verse and this song came to my mind so i sat there and i wrote it how much he loves us how much he loves you i can't believe he did it just for me that he scripture right here. For God so loved the world that he gave his only son that he would bleed and die for everyone. But this is what made me happy. But if upon this earth We'll see you in just a minute. Well, it's time to uh, invite our guest to be a part of the program. I enjoyed that Doesn't song. Doesn't feel good here today? Oh, yes. I enjoyed, that's what I was about to say. I enjoyed your singing 
that he did it just for me. I like that song. Thank you. You know, that song has a message, and I wrote it right out of the book. You know, mm -hmm. you can see that in that first verse. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten. Twenty-five words in that verse, and I used a part of it in that song. You did. And the yeah. guy that, uh, and his sweet little wife that we've got here today, I'm telling you, he just You talk write. about a songwriter. You talk, yes. Now, he Ooh. is a writer. <laughs> I'm telling you, one of the best and has been through the years. Through and so we're excited that they're yes. our guests. Are you ready to welcome them? I am. All right, let's make the, welcome Joel, Joel and, and Christy, Christy Hemphill. Hemphill. All right, we're just, we're glad you all are here. Glad Thank you here. so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Joel, oh, you just heard goodness. us talking because you were sitting there. Christy, can I get to you in just a minute? I've got to tell Joel publicly. Joel, you've been one of the greatest songwriters through the history of Southern Gospel well, music. Well, Christy probably knows that same thing, don't you? You can. Did, did you ever sing his songs before you were... Of course uh, I did. Really, sure. Mrs. Hemphill, did you? All I guess every, us. all of us did, didn't All of us have done Hemphill songs. Well, the Lord just too. let me hold the pen, that's all. I'll oh, and I say that again, I like that. All the glory, he just let me hold he the pen. Let you hold like the pen. Yeah. Like you know, that. I made a little note here. Uh, probably the the most famous song that you've ever written worldwide is is it He's Still Working on Me? That's true. Is that is the, that the uh, that's yeah. been your biggest? Of course, that was a blockbuster. It still yeah. is. Speaking of worldwide, let me just share this with yeah, you. Yeah, won't you? I got an email the other day in our office from a lady in Ohio, and she said I'm in management. Uh -huh. I manage people. Uh -huh. I don't know what. Yeah. She said a young Hindu man just stood at my desk and saying he's still, he's still working on me <laughs> Is that from right? India and she said how do you know that song and he said we were Hindu but I went to a Catholic school 3,000 kids and we started every day Joel with this song he still, said the kids loved it you could hear them the rest of the day sing it around you know, Doesn't that do young. something to your heart? Yeah, I did a lot, man. Wow. It'll make a Hindu you learned my song at a yeah. Catholic school in India. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's, That's awesome. fantastic. Well, you know, I, of course, I loved all your songs, and, and you're going to sing some of them today. But another song I always liked is Let's Have a Revival. That's yep. that's got that punch to it, you know that. That's because you sing it. Well, yeah. <laughs> that's one of his favorite songs. Let me, let me thank you, man. Yeah. I'd rather hear you sing it than me. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh yeah, well, you yeah. know how it is. Well, you we're it. talking about our favorite song. Do you have a fa what is your whether it's a Hemphill song or not? Do you have a favorite song? Well, I have to tell you, one of my favorite songs uh -huh. that you sing is "You Crossed His Mind." Oh my! Really? Yes, that's great. I have sung that song. Along many times when really? I was going through trials. That's great. You crossed his mind a thousand times a day. Love oh, song. bless your Did heart. That make your heart smile. That does. That just <laughs> makes my heart smile. You know, it does. People have asked me, and I'm sure they've asked you, you know, uh, what's uh, the greatest thing about writing a song and all that? And of course, we're always glad when we get the royalty check, you know. <laughs> but to hear people sing them, when they're doing their normal everyday things and they don't know that that a song that you penned, but you see it blessing them in everyday life. That's one of the biggest that blessings. Do you like That's that? It. Well, tell us what's going on. And uh, you're still preaching and singing? Singing. And hey, we had a wedding six weeks ago. I'm and not. you were there, Jane. I Mr. was there. Big we were there. Yeah. church wedding. Had 150 people there. Had a sit-down meal. Man, and that everything was, a was beautiful, blowout, and the George prettiest George. thing there was the bride. That's right. <laughs> and I have pictures yes, to prove. Yes, yes, yes. Well, we're going to show a picture for a gif. I don't know where we're ready. There we are, right there. Yeah, there, there we are. That picture was made at your wedding. That's that's. Yeah. And uh, now that's a beautiful picture. That's you know, you so and I both look pretty good standing by her, don't we? You know, uh, she, oh. she makes me look better. <laughs> huh? I told her stand close. You make oh, me yeah, look better. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> We're so glad to have that picture. Isn't it amazing what they pick up, where they get all these pictures? That was sent on the internet, I guess. We got that that picture almost by the time he got back home. I saw it before he got home. And I said, look what I've got. And he, he had not seen it. And he loved the fact that it was already on, on the internet before he got home. Now, <laughs> we, were, we were smiling as much in that picture as we were in it. Yeah, mm -hmm. you make us smile. Oh, oh you're just big night. Uh, friends, <laughs> but you know, I've friends. been to a lot of weddings. We all have, you know. But that's the probably as fancy a wedding as I've ever been to. A beautiful wedding and a sit-down dinner. 
you know, most of them we hear them say, I do, and then, then, you know, we all dismiss and go home. But we had a total, it was a catered dinner. What an evening Well, and people came from North Carolina, South they Carolina, did. Louisiana, different places. I'm we wanted to be meaningful and, and minister to all the couples there, yeah. you know. And so you did. Uh, we you prayed about that. that, and I believe it happened. Yes, yeah. it did. Yes, it did. What you want? Well, you've been Are singing you? a long time, too. How long have you been singing since you were how old? We won't say how long, but what time? <laughs> how old were you when you started? Well, of course, um, since my dad was a minister and my uh -huh. mom played the piano, we you started singing as soon as we could talk. <laughs> I guess you did, didn't you? Yeah. You have been singing Did you long. sing in church? I and did. then your family sang too. You we know. did. We were the Couch family. The yes. Couch family. I remember them. Of course, I, well, I was at your church just like Joel and his family. Right. You know, we all visited your church and sang with you folks. Sang with them? Yeah. Sang with them other places? Yeah. Georgia, Georgia the yeah. concert. Yeah. yeah. That was a fun thing. That was a fun thing. Well, tell me what you're writing now. Are you writing anything now? Or are you... I've been um, concentrating on matrimony yeah, that's here. Exactly. Lately, so I, was, I, I, was about, I was about to say that was not the right that word. That's been my focus here lately. Well, so, you know, courtship and courtship, yes. wedding and marriage and all that. So <laughs> let's, I'll get back to it. Okay, I'm thinking, Joel, let's, <laughs> let's co-write one, When the Bride Meets the Bridegroom, and we all Ooh. will be there. Oh, yeah, that'll when work. When the Bride Meets the Bridegroom at that meeting yeah, in the air. Hey, hey, hey listen. <laughs> <laughs> How about that? We could write that, couldn't we? Uh, we could. Uh, yeah. That's right. If you got another five minutes, it might be. It might all come out right That's now, true. Christy. We do it on the next show. Yeah, we push up a piano here and go for That's it. Right. And we got the other parts to help us. You make it sound Absolutely. good. Yeah, but we're, we want some of the royalties, Christy. Yeah. Oh. Make sure. <laughs> yes, we're here too. We want the royalties. <laughs> Well, you know, are you? Uh, I know y'all haven't been married long, but you're singing together already. I, we you are. Sing for We've us. done yeah. some concerts. And have you really? Have some old books. Uh huh. Absolutely. That's good. This, is, this lady just glows when she sings. Oh, I can she believe that. She glows when she all the time. Sing. That's right. That's so good. <laughs> well, it kind of put a new glow on you too, well, Joel. Well, then. Yes, sir. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Well, you know, in your songwriting, what was your first song you ever wrote, Joel? Wrote a song called "The Way Is Made." How old were you? The uh, way is made. I was 27. Never, 27. never had written, never wrote how does it poetry. Go? It says, uh, uh, there was once a mortgage on ever soul that could not be repaid with silver or gold. Uh -huh. Anyway, one who paid the price. Uh -huh. uh, we recorded it. it. It wasn't major, but it got me rolling. Uh -huh. And then yeah. right away I wrote, uh, I found a better way. Uh -huh. He filled a longing, not in a million years. Uh -huh. Pity the man. Ooh, they just, that's one of my favorite, Pity the Man. Go ahead. And just, Tell us some more. Let's begin to play. How many have you written? Probably close to 400. Wow. Close to 400. Yeah. Do you have a songbook per se? Or, you know, like this is the Joel I, Hemphill song? Yeah, we have. We, oh, do you? Mm -hmm. I've never seen one. I don't have one in my library. Well, we <laughs> you know my address? Uh, we, uh, well, get you one. <laughs> that's, yeah. what, that's what Christy and I do. Exactly. We help out, don't we? Exactly. That's good. We help y'all remember. The, I hope the, did you get the hint? That's, I will, yeah, we'll do it. We'll make sure you get one. Yeah, I'd love to have it because, you know, I like seeing what my friends have written through the years, you know. Well, have you ever written any songs? No. She just sings the good ones. <laughs> no. you, just, you just sing. Does anybody in your family write, like your dad? I know he's a preacher. Does he write songs? Sorry. No, but I had a thought this week about songwriters and how important they are because, like we spoke about earlier, the songs stay with you. I mean, true. very seldom does someone remember yes. a sermon, That's mm -hmm. you know, Christmas. years like later. Yes. But your songs are ministering forever. Absolutely yes. right. Absolutely right. That's good. And someday, we don't have time on here, but I have a, uh, a lecture on how God uses music to tell the church where we are in the plan of the ages. And I believe that true. I believe that's Ages. true. Yes. Yes, it is. Uh, uh, and I won't do it here, cause, but it's uh, one of the lectures I give. Because well, we got, we're so excited. Yeah, we're so excited about y'all being here. Thank and you. we Thank just you hope it won't be your last time to come and be with us. We want you to come back. They're ready for y'all to sing. So, uh, Christy, here's your mic, and Joel, your mic, and y'all can be excused and go to your place of, of uh, singing over there. And we're going to sing a song, and we're going to listen to them sing. Here's a song. 
that I think the first time I ever heard the Hemphill sing this song, we oh. were doing a concert in Newburn, North Carolina, and the promoting group was the Four in Christ, and I believe that was the first time I heard them sing, Consider the Lilies. Let's enjoy yes. as they sing, Consider the Lilies, the Hemphill. <laughs> The lilies, they don't toil nor spin, but they're not a king with more splendor than them. Consider the sparrows, they don't plant nor sow. But they're fed by the master who watches them grow. We have a heavenly Father above with eyes full of mercy. Introduce you to this friend of mine who hangs out the star, tells the sun when to shine, and kisses the flowers in the morning with dew. If the trumpet had sounded, 
So good, Let so me tell good. you before you get to talking, because oh. <laughs> okay. I want everybody out there to know okay. that, and I love your singing, you know that, but I'm, well, I'm prejudiced. So. Oh, sorry. I'm prejudiced now, okay. but Joel Hemphill is one of those singers uh -huh. I'm talking about from as long as I have been singing. Uh -huh. Joel Hemphill was the male vocalist in my heart. He really? He touches me Thank when he sings. You. Really? Thank he does. You. Well, yeah. I'm telling you, uh, he and does now, everybody, but you well, know. Well, now he touches Christy's heart yeah. too, doesn't he, Christy? <laughs> yeah. yes. But Joel, uh, you know, and I love his singing always and loved his family tremendously, but you are a country singer, aren't you? Well, you should see where I grew up. Baltimore, oh, really? Bill, Louisiana. Yeah, that's country. Is that out yeah. in the country? That's a mobile home capital of oh. Louisiana. <laughs> we had a tornado come through mm -hmm. Balkanville several years ago and did $9,000 worth of improvements. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You threw me That's a curve. Welcome, you really oh, did. Tell, you tell really us what did. You just now told us that. Oh, yeah. I want to hear that. My brother-in-law said it's the only place he knows where if your car is jacked up on blocks in your front yard, uh -huh. you get yard of the month from the garden club. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, that is so good. It's That's, That's, That's so good. Country. Oh, That's you good. know, I have such good memories of, oh. uh, of the years that I've known y'all and you and your family. And thank you for coming and being a part of the program. Thank and come back much. another Thank time. We would we, love to. We, we love it, we'd, And, you know, we'll make it someday when we, uh, we'll do the program and then we'll go out to eat and we'll just have an we evening, you know. Like that. <laughs> That'd be good. Yeah, yes, yes. We want to give you something before you leave, okay? First of all, we want to tell all of our viewers, we'd love to hear from you. Love, we'll look at our email and give us a little email shout and we'd love to hear from you. And we'd love to have you go with us on a cruise. So oh, yes. uh, ask about the cruise and, and we'd I love wanna, to work with you on the cruise. I want to give Christy this. Uh, it's it's uh, Echoes of My Heart, uh, a book that I've, I wrote, and it, just hope that it'll encourage you. That's, well, thank you that's very what much. I hope that it'll do. Thank you. It's a little part of me, Christy, for you and uh, Joel thank to read it much. together. And these are, these are just uh, stories. 
This actually is a, is a compilation book of uh, the first uh, four or five little books that I used to sell and write. But it's stories of things that happened in my life and, and things. For, it's like almost like a daily devotion book because no story in here is very long and uh, you can just read them. But it's pictures of people that we've sung with and places we've been and traveled. <clears throat> and I'd love for you to have it put it in your library and I'll wait for your songbook to be in mine, okay? okay. I didn't want we you to forget that, that so I'm added it in there. Well, we're glad that you've been with us. There you are, Joel. Thank Take you, it. God Jerry. bless you. And thank you again for being a part of it. Thank, thank you, Grace. Thank you very much. We enjoyed it. Write another That's song great. and come on back and introduce it. We'll make the <laughs> well, debut of the song on, right great. here on okay. the TV. That sounds good. And we'll cover the Southeast to sing. It's a brand new song from Joel Olympia. We thank you for watching. May God bless you. Stay tuned and tell a friend to join with us. And remember our motto, take Christ as your partner and enjoy, enjoy life. life. Yes.